My name is Ashton Newhall. I'm with Greenspring Associates and I'm the co-managing partner. The real heroes of, within this country are the entrepreneurs and the financiers of the innovation economy. And I'd love to see a recognition in tax policy at a macro level and at a state level to encourage and foster uh, innovation. And the fact of the matter is it seems on a macro level like the country is trying to move further and further away from what enabled it to be great. Um, and I'd love to limit the impediments to the financing of innovation. I'd love to foster the encouragement of innovation through financing, through tax policy, both locally and nationally. And so to the extent that our policymakers do not wish to see uh, people leaving the state that are the financiers of innovation, then they probably need to reflect that in the policies um, that would encourage said financing. Um, I guess the question is, how do we foster innovation in Baltimore? Well, I think there's a number of things um, that need to be done. First, as I say, on a uh, countrywide, federal level, we need to have tax policies that foster the financing of innovation. On a state level, the same thing is true. Um, on a local level, we need to create um, a greater incentives and system for people to use not only their time, but also their treasure to finance uh, innovative assets here locally. And I think there are a number of people that are leaders in trying to foster that environment. What Kevin Plank's doing is just um, awe-inspiring in my, in my view, uh, in terms of creating just let alone physical space for, for this type of activity to occur. Uh, what Frank Bonsell's doing in terms of the ed tech community um, uh, and taking a leadership role uh, is quite powerful. But I think, um, sadly, I think there, we need more. Uh, we need more people to, to give of their time and to give of their treasure. Um, I, I think the other thing that I'd like to be a part of the solution for is there is great financing risk to financing companies outside of the major power centers of innovation uh, because the power centers lead to the capital being based there. So one of the things that, that I'd love to be a part of the solution for is to help uh, the financiers of innovation be aware of the um, innovative assets that are spawning out of places, like Steve Case would say, that through the rise of the rest, the notion that the innovation economy is occurring more broadly going forward than it has in the past. And because we partner with those financiers, we'd like to think that we can make them aware of some of the companies that are growing right here in our backyard.